I've got my coffee. I've got some clips. <coughs> Sorry. Cheers. Have you ever been to Serbia? Have you ever been to Belgrade? Have you ever been in February? How about on a Tuesday? Let's see what a Tuesday in Belgrade in February is like. That. Good morning. We're in Belgrade, Serbia. Did you ever think you'd be in Belgrade, Doug? You made me sick. You gave me your cold. You make you me sick. <laughs> we leave in four hours, so there's not much to do. Not much we can do, but we do have a can-do attitude. Right, Chris? Please help me. <laughs> <laughs> so we did ask our hostel in Zagreb about what to see in Belgrade, since we're only there for less than a day. The ladies that worked at the front counter said, Belgrade is the New York of the Balkans. And boy, did that sentence the bar was set high. <laughs> so we had about six hours to see all of Belgrade. Some would say, oh, that's not enough time. It's the, the New York of the Balkans. I? Definitely too much. <laughs> so the main thing to see was the Belgrade Fortress. So we went there. Scanning this morning, yeah. Yo, you can't be tired. You can do whatever the f I won't. <laughs> it's in the bike lane at least. Yeah. It's safe. Breakfast was fine, I guess. Doug had a spaghetti bolognese. I had a eggs benedict. And it was hard boiled. So, so it was just hard boiled egg on bread. And now we're going to the Belgrade Fortress. We're on the grounds. Everyone ditched me. I'm alone. Where? There. And jump higher. Here? Yeah. As high as you can. Ready? Yeah. Three. Two. Wait, why did you hug? Huh? You made a, a good joke. That's how we show laugh. That's how we <laughs> show laugh? That's how we, we show, show laugh. Get out of my face, man! <laughs> what? Those stairs. <laughs> <laughs> Looks nice. So so that's why we wanted there. to go this way. No, do it, Doug. don't do it, don't do it, Doug. Bye, Doug. Doug, don't do it. I stand it. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, no, you, we could all get down there. Of course, but then where do we go from there? Ah, okay. Don't put your hands on the ground. There's really sharp it's things on the far ground. Far away. <laughs> We're gonna go down this way. Oh, there's a the it, it looks especially not that far <laughs> on the video. Oh! It's not that high. <laughs> Why the kick? <laughs> now this is pod racing. <laughs> Belgrade Fortress. Ah, it's kind of nice. Belgrade Fortress. What was your opinion of Belgrade Fortress? I liked it. What about you, Hartley? Hmm. It wasn't too bad. I like a good historical site. Yeah, it's shiny too. Cool. <laughs> you guys are idiots. <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> we walked into a church after that. Then we just walked around the main city, saw the main square, which is under construction. And uh, we packed and left. Now, the most memorable thing about Serbia was trying to leave. <laughs> because of the whole missing our bus in Vienna thing, we made sure to get to this train station super early. I think we were there for at least 45 minutes before our bus was supposed to leave. On our tickets, there's a platform, I think seven. Doesn't, you don't know, you don't remember, I don't remember. So I can say any number here. Four. Now we walk to the platform where we got dropped off and we're waiting, thinking, there's no way we're gonna miss this. Wow, imagine if we got stuck in Serbia, guys. Oh, that would be awful. I'm glad we got here half an hour mm. early. There's nothing that can go wrong now. Wow, we did it, guys. Everything's running smoothly. About 10 minutes before our bus is about to leave, we're all looking at our watch going, hmm. 
Our, we are at the right place, right? And we're looking around. There's not a lot of people around us. This is where we're supposed to wait, right? Hartley and Doug are playing basketball. Hartley's awful at <laughs> it. He didn't get it in once. So we're looking around. No one else is around us. 10 minutes until this bus departs. We're getting a little cautious here. <laughs> we see a couple people sitting on a bench. We ask them. We're trying to, this is our bus, where do we go? They just give us this, this, they do this, they do. We all look at each other, double take. We pack up our stuff and we run. So we have to run around the building to the front of where the bus terminals are. And we see a lineup for people to get onto the platform. Perfect. We all stand in line. We show the man at the gate our ticket. Oh, that's our bus. I can see the bus. This is our bus. We're leaving. Obviously doesn't speak English. He looks at our ticket and says no. I say, sorry, sir. Excuse me. What do you mean no? <laughs> this, is, this is the, that's the, I'm me backpack. That bus, we go vroom vroom out out. And he says, no ticket. And he points to a ticket booth behind us. Now I'm concerned. Did these tickets just not work? How does that work? And the lady that was running that counter did speak a little bit of English. How are you? We have a short, small conversation. No, we don't. And I say, this is our ticket. That's our bus. How do we get on? She says, ah, you need a ticket to enter the platform. Interesting. I say, ah, great. Six tickets, please. Now, when you're in a country for a day, you don't want to go to a bank and take out currency of that country. So far, throughout the day at all the restaurants we went to in Serbia, they were fine with card or euro. She gives us the amount in the Serbian dinar. I say, perfect, uh, thank you. I'll pay with card, please. And she says, no, <laughs> never matter. How about a euro for my fine lady? No, Ex <laughs> say that one more time, please, as I look at my watch. And she says, no. Hmm, damn boy. Time check, three minutes till bus departure. <laughs> She's very adamant that she would not take euro or credit card. I'm trying to have it with her. Chris and Josh try to go find an ATM and Doug busts through the gate. He just runs right through to try to hold up the bus. <sighs> There's three minutes left until this bus leaves and we don't want to be stuck in Serbia. I finally talked to this lady enough that I bribe her with euros and I said, I'll pay you in euros if you pay for these tickets. So I think I'd like over, I gave her too much money to get these tickets. At this point, there's one minute until departure and these bus drivers, they just leave. They don't care who's on it or not. We paid for the ticket, they're gone. I get the six tickets, I run to the gate. I see Chris and Josh on the other side of the platform at an ATM trying to fiddle with them. Let's go, we gotta go. Doug is there waiting no. at the bus like, guys, guys, we gotta go. The bus driver's pissed. Guys, this is our bus, this is our bus. We're at the door to the bus, the bags are in. Mans is like, wait. We say, excuse me, sir. He goes, that's five euros a bag, please. Come on, man. <laughs> nah, are you joking? At that point, it was, all right, whatever. Here's, here's five euros, and we get on the bus. Yeah! Serbia, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. That was a very stressful time in my life and um, I'm glad I get to share that story for future me and for my friends. And then we went to North Macedonia. That's for next episode. Bye. So now we're just gonna get some food and we're hopping on a bus. Belgrade in six hours. Serbia, this is, is as Serbia does, right? That's what they say. Food's good, people are nice. Food's good, food's really good. People are very nice. That Serbian hospitality, as they say. You can repeat everything I say. <laughs> Would you call this the New York of the Balkans? There was a river, there were angry taxi drivers, there were burgers. Italian people, I would say so. <laughs> Italian people? Really Italian. <laughs> <We're> the Italian. <laughs> Time to pack, we on the move. We already packed. We're still on the move though. Oh, we got some time. We, got to, we still got time to chill, but we're moving currently. Let me go to sleep, man. Serbia is exhausting. Why? Just being with you all the time. Always in front of the camera. Barely, you're you're always, al everything. always performing. Never performing. Constantly. Just posing. I'm not posing. Getting old. <laughs> I don't like this meme of making fun of me on my show. This is my show. Get out of here, you Doug, you. Get out of here. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Hi Chris, hi Josh, hi uh, Doug, hi Hartley, hi Paulo. I hope you guys are doing swell. I'll see you soon.